is the Burkey model exactly? So let's start by breaking down the terms. You have Burr, the Burr model is your traditional value add opportunity. It's buy, rehab, rent, refi, repeat. This is your traditional strategy where you buy a property for $60,000, you put 20,000 into it, so now you're 80,000 in, and because of the rehab you've just completed, you've now forced the value up to 100. So you're 80 in, but now it's worth 100. That's forced appreciation. And that, that particular dynamic about that model is what really draws everybody in. Now let's talk about the turnkey model, which you're probably familiar with if you're on this website already. This is more of a hands-off rental property strategy. You're buying an already rehabbed property with paying tenants, with property managers on standby, ready to manage the property for you. The very unique upside to turnkeys is that Number one, your money's not in the pot. If something goes wrong in that equation of the rehab, of the tenants, of the property, everything, it's on the turnkey provider. It's their money in the pot. So you as the investor, before you ever put any money down, you actually get to verify most everything about that property to ensure that you're getting what is advertised. That's huge. That's a huge unique advantage to turnkeys. The downside to turnkeys is that you're probably paying market value for them. And there's real, really no way to improve the property to force any appreciation. So that's what really holds people up on the turnkey side. Now let's combine these models. We have the Burr, which is the value add. That's where you're getting that forced appreciation. But you have the turnkey, which is the hands-off part where someone else is doing all the hard work for you. Well, if you combine those two things, look at the turnkey buying model. We already said that the turnkey provider is the one who buys the distressed property, they're rehabbing it, they're placing the tenants, they're getting property managers ready, and you're buying that product for them. So essentially in that equation, they're doing the value add part of it, the burr part, if you will, but the value add part, and then you're buying the finished product. Now, the burr keys, instead of buying the finished product and paying market value for that, you're the one funding the purchase of the distressed property and the rehab. So now let's say you put that $80,000 in, whereas normally the turnkey provider would have done that, but you put that money in now. And when it's now worth 100, these are all hypothetical, arbitrary numbers, but now if it's worth 100, you get to keep the forced appreciation. That is huge in the turnkey world because you don't normally get that. So that's the advantage and the why people are so interested in bird keys because now you have a way of doing the turnkey strategy where you're still primarily hands off and experts are doing all the work for you but now you also get to force appreciation pretty quickly in the equation and once you do that you get to do a cash out refi and get way more of your money out than you would have if you had bought a traditional turnkey the risk or the downsides is you have got to know who you're working with because now it's your money at risk. If anything goes wrong with the rehab or the tenant or the property or whatever, it's your money in the pot. That is the trade-off to the reward of being able to force that appreciation. So you can't work with just anybody on these properties because it's critical that you can trust who you're working with because your money is in their hands and they're doing all this work for you. If they skip off to the Caribbean, ooh, so don't work with just anyone on this. That's very key to understand. But if you find a good provider who offers this, a trustworthy one, this is an, this is an opportunity like I've never seen. I've been in turnkey world for years now, and this is the coolest new version of turnkey. One caveat is you have to use your own cash initially to buy the property and fund the rehab but then you get to pull all of that back out somewhere in the like three to six month range, just kind of depending on the deal. So you do get that money back out, but it does require more initial capital. So if you have any questions on the bird key model, do not hesitate to reach out. There's a link at the bottom of the page. You can check out some inventory, ask any questions you want because there's a million details I left out, but I wanted to video this to give you the basic understanding of the bird key model. I hope it helps.